Okay, Link Ray, Rawhide. Uh, in this lesson, I'm going to go over in detail the uh, guitar solo. Basically, I'm going to concentrate on uh, the picking techniques that I'm using to play this solo. Uh, I'm going to be covering double stops and uh, how I play them. In case you're wondering how to play the solo, like, you know, the frets, what notes to play, uh, go to my website because my last lesson was on this instrumental and I did post uh, tabs for the lesson. So the guitar solo I'm playing is pretty much the same as what I did in my last lesson. Okay, uh, the guitar solo is in the key of A major and I have standard tuning. Okay, slow tempo. Okay, you'll notice at the beginning Okay, I'm using all downward uh, sweeps with the pick And here Okay, all downward sweeps playing those notes. And also, I was playing all the notes on the second and third string. That's the B string and the G string. Uh, it could be done here on the E and B string. Okay, now we get uh, to this part here. That's an E major. Uh, instead of playing a triad, E major chord, here, I'm just gonna play two notes, and that's gonna be the uh, B and the E. And the same goes for the D major chord down here. Okay, the technique I'm using there, you notice I'm doing alternate picking. Down, up, down, up. So alternate pick, um, don't hold your pick too tight. Uh, and also, don't hold it too loose, otherwise it's going to slip out of your fingers. Uh, kind of keep it in a relaxed state. And you notice, I've got this part of my hand resting on the bridge here. And also, Notice all the movement is on the wrist. And you notice my fingers, I've I've got my fingers curled in like this. Um, that's the way I prefer to do it. Um, you know, other people might be holding their fingers out. I don't know if there's really a right way or wrong way of doing that. I just like to keep them in like this.
Okay, I'll play it at tempo. Okay, there I was playing it pretty much the way I did uh, in the previous lesson. I was playing chords up here. Okay, uh, just to recap, um, remember don't grip the pick uh, too tight. Uh, you're going to put a lot of strain on your fingers in your hand. Um, and, get, and also don't hold it too loose, it's going to slip out. Um, keep the movement in your wrist. And also, I maybe I forgot to mention this earlier, is uh, when you're picking, uh, um, just kind of keep your pick at an angle. You don't want to just pick, have the pick parallel with the strings. You want to keep it at an angle. That way it glides across the strings a lot easier. Okay, that's all for this lesson. I hope you enjoyed it and thanks for watching. Bye.